<laughs> okay, hello! So, JD and I, we're gonna open another package that I got from one of my viewers. Um, it's a pretty tightly taped package. Very much so. <laughs> they did not joke around with it. <laughs> okay, this package came to us from China. Mm. <laughs> so, thanks a lot, Dan. Yes. Let's, let's try to get this tape off here. I'm not sure. Wow. Was it opened by customs or? Well, I, I can read kanji it be to Chinese, some extent, but Chinese customs. Chinese kanji a, is a little different. They've taken so. a nibble or two. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Well, I thought that was the top. <clears throat> wow. I'm not sure if I want to do a blind taste test with JD or not. <laughs> Maybe. Well, we'll take take a quick look and see if I should uh, burn my eyes. <laughs> It looks like we've got some Oreos in here. Oh. Um, yeah. They. Oh, it's it's a lot of Oreos. <laughs> mm. Wow, many many Oreos. I like this already. That's all that's in here is Oreos, and there are five different flavors. Dude, you want to do it? I want to do it. Okay, sorry. I, I didn't. I didn't have any milk. I didn't even think. Oh, well, <laughs> Monster and Oreos. Monster. Okay. Morios. Mo Morios. Okay. So he, he put a, a letter in here. Just let me have a quick read here. Oh, don't no, look at the flavors. JD. Oh, right, right, right. These are unique flavored Oreos found in supermarkets in China. I hope you enjoy them. Okay. Yes. Thank you, Dan. I'm sure we will enjoy them. Indeed. <clears throat> Alright, I'm not looking. There's a method. You can to my show them to, show to the camera, tell me when I can open my eyes. Same standard procedure. Okay, let's let's start with <laughs> the camera. Standard procedure. For anyone who can read Chinese, I mean you Oh can, yeah, that's you, true. Well is there still a picture? Don't look, there's a is, picture. Yeah, I was okay. gonna say there's probably yeah. a picture on there. So there you go. That's what we're getting into for the first one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm assuming they're all the same, but inside each of these boxes there are small packets. Uh, Which is good because it keeps them fresh. Right. Um, you can imagine in the humid. You talking about like a sleeve? Hot, humid summer. Yeah. There's a sleeve. I'm not sure if I should show you the sleeve. Me? If it'll give away the flavor if is you saw the picture? color of the sleeve or not. Well, I've seen colors of stuff in the past and it. Okay. Just put one in my hand. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. I smell oh, strawberry. It, you lost a piece, but there you go. Okay. <laughs> I smell strawberry. Okay. I I'll, already think this I'll is hide strawberry. This away. Just from. All right. Give it a go. I'm gonna have one too. You can. Yeah. Oh yeah. You can smell that. But yeah, they're very thin. Hmm. Very. Very. They're. Would you say the diameter is smaller than a normal Oreo? A little bit, I'd say. Maybe no, it's a, a metric well, Oreo. A <laughs> metric Oreo. <laughs> and it's a very well, thin cookie and a very thin amount of filling. Strawberry. It's gotta be strawberry. All right. There it is. That's what it is. Yeah, let me just let me just double check what that's I think. Called. Well, I mean, I've had strawberry. Okay, Oreos yeah. Before. Strawberry yogurt is what it's called. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. It's hard to tell the yogurt, mm -hmm. but okay. Good job, JD. You know your Oreos. One for one, or one for yeah, one. One, <laughs> one for one. Yes, yes. One for one. Okay. <laughs> All right. Next. Number two. Okay. Next, we're gonna let him try this. <clears throat> I need to really rinse. Yeah. <laughs> so this one may be a little more challenging. I do this enough, I probably get good at it. Yeah. <laughs> Official Oreo tester. <laughs> but what's the? Is it? Uh, I think it's on Kitchen Nightmares, the Gordon Ramsay show. He does the blind mm. taste test thing. Have you ever seen that? Um, is it Kitchen Nightmares? Kitchen Nightmares, he usually... Well, or maybe it's MasterChef. Maybe MasterChef. I've, in Kitchen, Kitchen Nightmares, Nightmares, he usually just Hell's says, Kitchen. You all are terrible! <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah. Okay, here's the next one, JD. <laughs> Anyhow, never mind. Sorry about that comment. <laughs> Derailed the, the review here. Alright. So, the, yeah, these one, this one's a little thicker than the previous one. Bubble you can see that. Cup. Yeah. So this is more of a normal-sized Oreo, even though, I'm, I don't know, the diameter still seems... On smell sure. alone, I'm gonna go ahead and venture wow. guess bubble gum. Wow! I see where you're coming from with that. It's a very. Yeah. Yeah, the smell is distinctly bubble gum. What color is it? It's. Looks pink and purple. What on earth? Pink and. It's like it's purposefully. Hmm? Is there blueberry in here as well? Hmm. Okay. If it's not bubble gum, my second guess would be blueberry. Or maybe okay. both. No, I think you're, you're onto something there. Here's what it is, JD. Is it? it is a mix between blueberry and raspberry. Ow. So just look. Points for blueberry, at least. Yeah, yeah. But I, when when I smelled it too, I'm like, what is that? 
I thought I, bubble I saw gum. the box. Yeah, it's a very sort of bubblegummy kind of smell. But hmm. looking at the box, I do want to open yeah. one of them. Yeah, when I looked, I was like, wait, is that that side's blue? Like kind of a... Ah, uh, I see. Like a lavender color, and this one's pink. So you cheated. <laughs> what, because I looked? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> it looks like bubblegum on this side, right? <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it's cool. It's, it's split uh, both ways, two different colors. I'm just going to hmm. put that aside. I'm going to give myself the point on that one. Because we got more to eat. Yes. Okay. <laughs> so, so two uh, for two. Or maybe a half point, because it's half and okay. half. <laughs> okay, next. Let's do this one here. This one may be a little trickier. I'm not sure. So in the letter, he explained that, that this one that we just ate, this is the normal kind of larger ones. All the rest are sort of the thin variant of the, of the Oreo line <clears throat> in China. Okay, there we go. Whenever you get oh, JD. All right. Give that a go. Smell test. This, is it another thin one? It's a thin one. All the rest are thin. That, oh. that previous one was the only sort of normal one. Ooh, this is challenging. Not a, good, not a thick smell to go by like the other ones. Mm. These ones are a lot harder to open as well. Whoa! So yeah. Maybe chocolate? <laughs> chocolate cream? All right, let's just eat it. Now that I'm looking at it, <laughs> is it just a normal Oreo that's thinner? <laughs> I think that's a that's a good guess. It's actually wait 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 don't tell me. If you would if you would call the the normal Oreo vanilla, yeah, is it? Would you call it vanilla? Somehow I wouldn't. Like it's more of a chemical flavor. <laughs> the, <laughs> the, the original normal flavor, hmm. just a cream flavor. But I, yeah. yeah, it's just. Kind of tastes like a normal Oreo to me. I don't yeah. know if that's a, if it's, is that a thing. Yep, it's uh, vanilla mousse. Mm. So it's not quite the same as a normal Oreo. I didn't think mm. a little fancier. Yeah, that's what it was. If you gave me like a normal Oreo and one of those, maybe I could tell the yeah, difference. Yeah. But could you get a hint of vanilla in there? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So three for three. Uh, two and a half for three. Two and a, <laughs> two, two and a half for three. Okay. Well, well, yeah. Okay. Two okay. and a half for three. Let's go to the next one. <laughs> you ready? Mm hmm. Okay, so I'm going to bring it out and I will show it to the good folks at home. Hopefully, they thought that looked good. Nobody, please don't shout out the answer. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> okay, another thin one. I feel like I'm throwing a fish to a dolphin at SeaWorld. <laughs> 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 All right. Um, okay, this one. Whoa, it has a faint, very it's faint, a funky smell. I'm getting something, but I can't identify yeah. it. Oh, what is that? Like, I feel like I know, I know. the smell. <laughs> can I open it? You can try. These thin ones are hard to open. There we go. What you talk about? Perfect. Oh, you're good. Jozu. Oh, oh, what is that? I recognize the smell. Uh, what is that? What is that? Oh. I'm gonna. It's gonna be one of those flavors that after I hear the answer, I'm gonna kick myself like. Duh. You might be eating. You might be able to guess it. All right, let's give that a shot. Based on smell, it might be harder. I feel like I might miss this one, so I'm just gonna eat the cream stuff. <laughs> ah, what is, is it? Um, it's like it's a flavor I recognize, but yeah. is it custard? No. Uh, give me another one. <laughs> give me another give one. Me another one. one. I want to get this. It doesn't matter now. You've yeah. seen the package, but hmm. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna say custard, okay. but yeah, if I'm wrong You're and picking I picking up the custard because it it's actually a cheesecake flavor. So oh. Something cheesecake. I can see that now. You got it. Yeah. So yeah, it's lemon cheesecake, is what it is. Oh, I should have said citrus. I was, I was tasting the citrus, but you I'm like... You probably thought it was that. Yeah. Mm. You got one more to redeem yourself. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm still I'm still over par. I'm All above right. par, I think. Like, if half is par. I don't know. Okay, anyway, go for it. So, oh yeah, everyone at home, this is the final flavor. <laughs> Hopefully you can read that Chinese there. So, this one's a bit... Crushed, okay. Well, that, it's open. Yay. <laughs> oh, that one's a bit crushed. Let me give you a nice, there you go. That'll improve your odds. All right. Okay. All right. Mmm, smells really good. What are you smelling? Is it? Hmm. Okay. Let me get a look at this. 
Well, it's kind of crushed, as he said. Yeah. Okay. I kind of got it open. <laughs> A little bit. Yeah. Hmm. It's brown in color. It's brown. So, obviously chocolate comes to mind, but what kind of chocolate? What are you smelling? Chocolate mousse. You smelling chocolate? Oh! Or, or, wait, 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 I want, new, I want one more. <laughs> oh, one more? Yeah. Okay, those all. Wow, this is pretty broken, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Or some kind of nut. Like a hazelnut or something. I can see that. Mm. Okay, so, mm, I'm gonna go with but like... Me, me agreeing to that doesn't mean that that's what yeah. it is. Okay, but still though. Okay, I'm gonna trust my nose on this one and say it's either like a, a, a chocolate mousse or a hazelnut. Mm, something with nuts. I, I I feel like something with nuts. But it is a well, mm. I can't say. Okay, or, well, what, is say. what is it? What is it's it? It's not a nut. It's a bean. A bean. <laughs> a cocoa bean? I mean, not a cocoa bean. <laughs> Why my bean? It's a coffee bean. It's actually really? tiramisu. That's made with coffee, right? Like yeah, I'm getting yeah. that coffee smell. Hmm. So yeah, it's tiramisu, tiramisu, tiramisu mousse maybe. Let me just double check here. Oh, just tiramisu, which is a it's a kind of dessert, right? Mm, so it's, yeah, yeah. it's sort of a moussey kind of dessert. Mm, you get okay. that now that you know what it is or not? No, they should have added more of a coffee really, flavor to it. My initial sniff, <laughs> I thought this is totally coffee. He's gonna get. It. He's gonna say coffee. And I'm gonna have to say you're close, uh, but then you you didn't say coffee, so I was like, oh, yeah, it's not because you weren't thinking coffee, were you? This, well, see, the reason I'm saying hazelnut is because yeah. there's... when you said that, I was like, oh yeah, I can see that. It's yeah. it's way more hazelnutty than it is coffee. Like, mm. like I I've been to Starbucks many 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 times, and um, like they have, you can you know get the aroma of them. Uh, of the beans when you're in, or, or better yet, Caldi. I, I don't know if Caldi's international, but Caldi, you know, the smell when you walk in that place house, is, yeah. is a coffee house. Yeah. And that and this are a little different. This right. is too sweet of a smell to be coffee. Have you had the dessert, tiramisu? Oh, many times. I love yeah. tiramisu. And do you, but this, when you eat it, do you think this is coffee or do you think this is I think, a light coffee or? Um, well, I don't get hazelnut when I uh, eat tiramisu. Okay. That's the thing. It's a, yeah, I get well, coffee and chocolate and sweetness, but <laughs> it's all <yeah>. the Chinese. <laughs> <laughs> I don't so, know. <laughs> whatever. Okay. Well, anyhow, that was fun. Mm. I really like that. Thanks a lot, Dan, oh. for sending us those different Oreos. Mm. Um, so vanilla, tiramisu, lemon, cheesecake. That was the bubblegum one. And the strawberry mousse. Hmm. Well, okay. This, this is for this me. Is tough. For me, the strawberry mousse is out. I've never been a huge fan of like kind uh, of the fake chemically okay. strawberry, so that's out for so me. So it's at the bottom. That's at the bottom. Okay. Um, so best to worst. This kind of this was interesting. I'm not yeah. sure if I like it because it's interesting or or if it actually tastes good. Right. It's fun. I like the double flavor thing. Um, the the normal or what was it? The vanilla one. Vanilla. The vanilla, vanilla is just a bit too. Oh, this one. Okay, yeah. it's a bit too plain for me. I mean, I might as well just be eating normal Oreos. I thought mm -hmm. so. Like, if you're trying to keep my interest. Cheesecake, lemon cheesecake. I liked this one, and it was fun trying to guess it. And at the end, when I said custard, and I was like, oh, uh, cheesecake, lettuce, and I was like, why didn't I say citrus? Uh, <laughs> so. Yeah. Hmm. I. Hmm. Because okay, I'm gonna say. This one's first, this one's second, Tiramisu is third. Oh yeah, that's, top three, okay. That's, yeah, in this order, so, yeah. I, I, I enjoyed this one quite a bit, the, the lemon cheesecake one. That was good. Yeah. And I, I like this one as well, because it's got a really strong flavor, and then I was just like, oh wow, was that blueberry bubblegum or something? Yeah. Um, and then Tiramisu. Tiramisu could, well, have well. Been, could have been better. It's not bad, I would totally eat that again. The only problem is, it's not living up to its claim to be tiramisu, in my opinion. Right. But, and then the other two, I was kind of eh. So. so I think I agree. I like this one the best. This may be my second favorite, though. Really? The, the strawberry? strawberry one. Mm. And then my third favorite, this vanilla one. I'm not really a coffee fan, so I don't really like uh. that one. <laughs> I do like hazelnuts, though, so I don't, I don't know what to say about <laughs> yeah, that. Like <laughs> um, but this one kind of 
like you said, it was sort of bubblegum, and I didn't know how to how to how to interpret that one, so it was a bit right. weird. But anyhow, this would be my top three. <laughs> I think we both agree that the, the cheese lemon, lemon cheese the lemon cheese cake is quite is good. the winner. Yes. So there you go. There's five <laughs> different Chinese Oreos. Yeah. Thanks a lot, Dan, for sending them to us. We're going to be <laughs> enjoying these Oreos for the next several weeks, probably. <laughs> Make sure we, oh, these are already open. We got to eat them first. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We'll sneak them into the movie later. Awesome. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so thanks for watching, and we'll catch you guys in the next video. See you later. Mm -hmm.